Step 1 is to disable SIP system integrity protection using CSR UTIL in recovery mode. Before disabling system integrity protection let me show you my Mac OS version which is installed in my system and the status of network. Just to show you currently my system is not connected with any network. I recommend you to watch this video till the end. As you can see Mac OS Catalina version 10.15.3 and the system information here. And here is the network status of the system. Now reboot into recovery mode. Now click Utilities. Select Terminal. Type CSR UTIL Disable. Now close the terminal and click to restart the machine for the changes to take effect. Step 2. Open the terminal and type the following command to mount the file system. Put your account login password here. With this our second step is also finished here. Close the terminal. Step 3. It's time to install latest version of Horindi's 9.2 package. I had already downloaded it. You can download the same from the link given in the description box below of this video. Or in these installation is complete, restart the machine for the driver to be loaded. Now to verify that the driver is loaded or not for that please follow the steps. As you can see driver is successfully loaded here hor in these dot text file. To get started using hor in these, you will need to enable Android phone's native USB tethering mode to get internet access. To do so, connect your phone to your computer using the USB cable. Here I am showing you. How you can enable USB tethering on your phone settings. After enabling the USB tethering on your phone settings you have to restart your machine. Your machine should subsequently detect the device and connect to the internet. Now let me show you the network and the status of the internet access. As you can see here my machine has got the internet access. 
to verify and to show you from where you can download the whole in these latest version driver. Let me open the Safari browser. From this website you can download the driver. That's it for this video and thanks for watching I hope you found this video useful don't forget to subscribe to this channel for interesting tech videos. Please hit the bell icon for notification of my new videos. Also hit the like button and share this video with your friends and comment it would be great to know your opinions about my tutorials you can also make request for new tutorials. See you soon.